Okay, it's uh, time for physics fun uh, on animated science. We are looking at resonance. It's 2nd of December, getting close to Christmas, but I thought I'd do something a little bit fun with re resonance. So here I've got two tuning forks. Both are A, or 440 hertz, but I've got a little, little bit on here that changes it. So look, what I'm going to do is show you. That's what it sounds like with it like that. And if I take it off, it's a different sound. Now, okay, what am I looking at resonance for? Well, here I have a little ping pong ball. And if obviously you strike a tuning fork, the time goes backwards and forwards, doesn't it? And it makes the ping pong ball move. And my little box here um, gives out a sound, a resonance sound, effectively. And I'm going to try and transmit it. But if you look now, with this little weight put on, it changes the frequency coming this way. So I'm going to hit it really hard. Nothing's happening, nothing at all. So I'm going to remove the little weight so we get a proper A. A little bit of movement. Now if I move it a bit closer, now you've heard the sound, so the sound is getting transferred. There you go. So this one is making this one oscillate due to resonance. So it's a force motion it's pushing and pulling the tines but it's just by it's like a driven oscillator if you think of it but with a sound wave and obviously the closer i am the more that ping pong ball is feeling the force and i can stop the time and it stops it if i pull it away you could hear it more That's working quite well from that position. So it depends if you vary a bit on the effect you get. But there you go. Resonance with tuning forks.